I'm a doctor. Is there a good way to check out a memory complaint? No matter how experienced a doctor you are, you can't tell a patient's blood pressure without checking figures from a blood pressure test. Neither can you diagnose pneumonia unless you listen to your patient's chest. It's the same with someone who comes to you with a memory complaint. You can't draw conclusions about their memory function until you put some figures on it and carry out a brain health check. What does a brain health check look like? Well, there are five steps to remember when dealing with a person's memory. Number one, know the history. Like with any patient, listening to their story is crucial. You need to understand the concerns, checking with family members where possible, to see if there's anything else that could be interfering with their memory. Step number two, gather evidence. A brief physical examination and a blood test could pinpoint a treatable and even reversible cause for a patient's memory loss. Things like hypothyroidism or B12 folate deficiency. Number three, give a test. A short cognitive examination puts a number to the problem, allowing you to make an informed conclusion. To assess their cognitive function, use pen and paper tests that evaluate memory, thinking and reasoning. Step number four, refer for a second opinion. Completing a brain health check should help clarify what's going wrong, but it can also reveal whether you're in a position to offer further help or if it's best to refer your patient to a specialist for a second opinion. Hello. And that leads right to number five, give advice. Whatever the outcome of their cognitive assessment, whether they have a memory problem or not, offer informed advice on lifestyle changes that they can make for the sake of their brain. Think of these five steps when someone presents with a memory complaint. These steps are good to know, especially when the number of people over 65 is rising and you're going to deal with more memory problems in the future. Which all means now is the perfect time to add brain health to your patient checkup routine. <laughs>